decorate my Christmas ornament, I am using this origami paper from Yasutomo, and this is the folk art pack, and then I have another piece that's a little bit shiny, and I am just cutting my strips down into one inch pieces, and then down to one inch squares, and they don't have to be perfect. I'm just quickly cutting them here on my paper cutter. And like I said, they don't have to be precise. I've seen ornaments done um, with fabric and I've seen, you know, pouring paint and paint and um, alcohol inks. And this is just another option is to cut down your pieces. And then we're going to Mod Podge them onto our ornament after we have cleaned it. So I am just going to dip into my Mod Podge. And the kind I'm using here is gloss. You could use matte gloss. It doesn't really matter. And I'm just going to give a quick coat to get started. Now I'm going to be covering this entire ornament. Alright. So then I'm just going to take my papers and start sticking them on here. And then after a few have been placed, we can definitely work back over them to make sure that they are completely stuck down. To finish off my ornament after it has dried, I am just going to take some of this glitter ribbon. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I've already tied a bow with it that's going to go on the front. But to finish off, I want to um, wrap the neck with a piece of the ribbon. And I actually had to cut it down a little bit so that it would fit better around the neck. And so now I'm just going to apply some tacky glue around this outer edge here. And then I'm going to take my ribbon starting in the front because I'm going to hide that underneath the bow. And then you can cut off the excess. Right, and I'm just going to put a little bit more glue on that so it sticks down. Just give it a tight squeeze. Now the ornament I'm working on is plastic, but of course glass would work as well. With this technique, I'm going to take the lip lid to the ornament and put that back on first. All right. Now, if you wanted to, you could have wrapped around the lid or you could put the lid over the ribbon. I like it over the ribbon like so. All right. And of course, this could be finished perfectly just like this, but I'm going to add my bow here onto the front. And just put a decent amount of glue. And I'm not going to glue the entire thing. I'm just going to glue under the knot. And so I'm just going to take this and glue it right on the front like so. Just hold it in place for a few seconds so it dries. <laughs> 